Howdy, folks. Welcome to Cape Cast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times. Today, we're on the railroad tracks out in West Barnstable, searching for robins. Oh, not one or two of the little worm eaters. We're looking for thousands and thousands of robins that apparently fill the sky around dusk. They roost for the night, bed down, do that kind of robin sleep thing. Then they head out for meals in the morning. Don't see them yet. But we'll find those red-bellied pals. I hope. Cape Cast. This whole robin thing started because I woke up one morning in Wellfleet and a bunch of robins were eating every single berry off my beautiful holly bush. And I used to like robins, but they were all there. Gulp, 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 gulp. The red berries just going down their gullets. They're fat, roaming around. And I started thinking, oh, what is going on with this? Okay, eat all the berries off my holly tree, but why, Robins, why do you have to poop all over my picnic table? So through the bird vine, the grapevine, the bird vine, we heard that they were roosting, you know, hanging out at night in giant numbers up by the railroad tracks in West Barnstable behind the post office. I've been birding on the railroad all my live long days. But at first I didn't see any robins, and shamefully I then condemned all naturalists. One thing I can't stand is being lied to by naturalists. Oh, I know their game, and they've gotten me before. Oh, there's a zebra in Sconset. Oh, there's a giraffe at Sasuit Harbor. You know what? <laughs> they almost got me with that manatee over there too, but I didn't go for that. And now, where are the robins? I see nothing. Oh. There they are. We heard they were roosting down in West Barnstable. Down along the railroad tracks with more than a handful. We went out to see them as kind of a lark. But I gotta tell you, it got kind of spooky after dark. Invasion of the robins, to them the world's a worm. They're all lining up to get themselves a turn. Invasion of the robins, yeah, and if they're able, they'll eat all your berries and poop on your picnic table. So Ian, what's going on with these robins? These robins uh, that you're seeing at West Barnstable are robins that spend their summertime up in the Maritimes of Canada, and that's where they breed. And in the winter, they make their way down to here. This is their Florida. And they will flock uh, in large numbers. It's not unusual to see thousands of them in, in these roosts. And so the best time to see this roost is in the morning at around dawn. They'll be taking off in large numbers simultaneously. And you can also see them at night when they're returning from their, from their day of foraging. And it's just a really great sight to see. I call it the Robinanza. <laughs> well, we've learned a little bit about robins. They like to travel in groups. And we got to walk down the railroad tracks in West Barnstable, which felt kind of old school. This is a weird sight of birding. Sort of kind of sinister. Whoa! And away they go. Cape Cass. We have found robin tracks in the snow. They're everywhere, like little dinosaurs. Do you want me to scoop them up? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 